The art design is probably one of the most memorable parts of Wolf Cop. It was one of those things where you work with someone and you see how much dedication they have, how hard working they are. Justin can do pretty much anything. We're not going to be able to see that one. You want to see some tilts up to the sky? Yeah. yeah <laughs> he's the kind of person who you know when he's on the project, you don't have to worry about anything. Now, you may think it's a little strange that the production designer is decoying the vehicle. Normally, you'd be right. However, on Wolf Cop, if you were to go around the corner right now, you'll actually find the star of our movie fixing another car. It's all part of the uh, can-do attitude we have around here. I don't mind if the world knows that deckling cars is really unpleasant. We don't have lots of time and money on Wolf Cup, but we do have the most talented set deck people in the world. Uh, my name's Adrian. I'm the decorator. And yeah, we're building uh, Willie's crazy conspiracy lair. Willie's uh, the the classic sidekick character. He's eccentric, he's an outcast, he's the one in town who has all these theories that everyone's like, this guy's crazy. It's a, it's a real independent feature where we've gotta, gotta use our wits to, uh, to solve a lot of problems. A lot of movies will have uh, sponsors or will have product placement, but uh, but this is a small, small Canadian independent movie and we don't really have any of that, so that just means that, that we have to create everything. That's also most of the fun. I have, I, that's some of the most fun I have in the job is creating all these hilarious images or graphics or uh, brands, posters, anything. You know? It's a lot of fun. <laughs> that's a quality human being right there. <laughs> that's just before the, uh, the big drug bust. <laughs> He's reformed. It's, it's really great uh, to try to, well, to be able to pull off amazing looking sets on zero money with zero crew and zero time. There's a lot of throwbacks to 70s horror and 80s horror and 70s and 80s comedy as well. Uh, so we're sort of, that's the world we decided to live in design wise. And you could put this in three different decades and it still works, which is sort of cool. You've got to put in a little bit of extra effort. It's not really a nine to five, but uh, the payoff is much better. That's for sure. 